Hi, I'm Erin Harrison with the TMC Newsroom. Here are the top stories for September 7, 2010. A new report ranks the top 10 telecom operators around the globe with AT&T at the top of the revenues chart. In its Worldwide Telecoms Market Share Report, research firm Analysis Mason reported that AT&T is followed by NTT, Verizon, Deutsche Telekom, Telefonica, Vodafone, China Mobile, France Telecom, Telecom Italia, and KDDI, respectively. The Worldwide Telecom Market Share Report also reveals that the global telecom market produced an income of $1.8 trillion in 2009. This represents a 1% increase when compared to the income produced in 2008. Some familiar names surface in the list of the top 10 operators by revenue. Salesforce.com has been doing exceedingly well in the market for the past year with a very strong uptrend and the growth rate continues to push higher and higher, making a new all-time high for the stock. Smart Trend, a proprietary pattern recognition system, found that the shares of the company hit a new 52-week high of $116.69, closing higher by 6.52 on above average volume. The investors that got in early last year are enjoying a more than 110% gain on their investments, which, despite the overbought state, has only provided a handful of good entry points as the stock moved through its steep uptrend channel. And think you are paying too much for a cup of coffee? Evidently, Starbucks wants BlackBerry owners' money, too. BlackBerry owners can now download the Starbucks Card Mobile app just like an iPhone can. Apart from buying coffee, the BlackBerry app also allows users to keep track of their balance on their Starbucks card. The BlackBerry Starbucks app generates a barcode, which is then passed through a scanner for any purchase from Starbucks. The app has keyboard navigation, not touchscreen, but other than that, it's pretty similar to the iPhone version. You can purchase your Starbucks purchase card, find nearby Starbucks locations, check your balance, and track points earned toward free beverages. That's all for today. For these stories and all the latest news from the communications world, visit TMCNet.com. I'm Erin Harrison with the TMC Newsroom. Thanks for watching.